I just remembered. I actually have <laughs> a hole set up right here. I was going to use this on the Rover. I have another one, but I was going to use it on the uh, antenna tracker. Let's see what all we got in here. Uh-oh, looky there. What is that? It looks to me like a brand new airspeed sensor. The hull shoot match in a sealed bag. <laughs> so, it's been a hell of a day. <laughs> so, I took the old one out. I will... Uh, attempt to repair this one or like I say solder to those four pads it's just a clock and data I took the new sensor and <laughs> installed it where the old one was but instead of running it up through the top with all that junk I just ran it through the front <laughs> I really do think it will be fine uh, it's not quite straight <laughs> But that's just me. Uh, but I really don't see why that's not going to stick out far enough to... I mean, it should stick out far enough to stay out of enough turbulence to work well. In my thinking, there may be a wave in front of this, but I don't think it's going to come up to the static holes. And the dynamics in the tip. So. It's a little bit angled up. <laughs> sure it has to be calibrated. So there's an airspeed calibration. Got to be done on that again. So there's the plane. Ready to fly again. Uh, don't know what else to say. Thank you guys.